Oh, oh, oh hello there, audience. Uh, how, how are you doing today? Uh, I, I'm, I'm doing well. Uh, you know, I'm just, you know, sitting here uh, looking at my cool base. Um, not, not totally, not, uh, didn't build this, uh, in a video that, uh, I didn't record the audio for, uh, d please, please, no, 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 I did not do this. Yeah, so, uh, I recorded an entire video of us getting a blaze farm and realized halfway through it that my microphone was muted. This farm works pretty good here. Uh, I actually do have the footage from it. Uh, so I'll go ahead and just play a little time lapse for you guys. Uh, just watching the footage, kind of me building it, stuff like that. Maybe maybe cut to the important parts of it. All right, guys. So yeah, uh, I made a made a mistake here. Didn't get the recording for our our spawner over there. But uh, today, guys, we're gonna be going ahead making a villager breeder, pretty much a vanilla one, because in Power we want to make these spirited reactor. Uh, we want to make four of these for our new base, and these are green, so it's just gonna be perfect. And we're gonna make a total of four of these. So yeah, we're gonna need quite a bit of this stuff. Now, in order to get this spirited crystal, we need to convert emeralds into this using our energizing system here. If you guys remember a few episodes back, we set this up. Now, we may need to upgrade this, but I think we're okay for now. Uh, it just might take a little bit longer, and I've got all the time that we need. And what the heck happened here? Oh, that's right. I broke it. So yeah, uh, there is a village close to where we are. So we can go ahead and actually get those guys over here. And we're going to set up a, an area up in our kind of over by our system, where we're going to be setting up our villager breeder area thingy. Okay, guys, so I am here in the nether because I need a ghast. We need to get the ghast here so we can make the mob imprisonment tool. And as you can see, our quarry is doing work. Holy crap. We might be able to make up a really good mob farm here if we keep this up. Um, what I mean by that is if this is all dirt, we can vein mine pretty easily all the stuff okay so let's see if we can get a gas tier from this guy he did lock on to us and everything here you can blow up all right come here oh yeah look at that first try all right guys so the villager area is complete for now we can go ahead and expand this whenever we want to uh but this will prevent uh, zombies from getting to them at all. So now we need to go ahead and go fill up these mob imprisonment tools, steal a few beds, and bring some guys back. All right, so in here we got nothing. Okay. First house was a dud. We got a iron golem. Very cool. In here we got some bread. Not all the way a dud. All right, so in here, we should have a bed. Yep, we can go ahead and steal that. And then we should hopefully have another bed up here. Yep, cool. Then we got, oh, some more bread. We even got some potatoes, cucumber seeds, pumpkin seeds. Yeah, we are so taking this. Making some farms. All right, so first villager, here you are. Bam, got him. All right, second villager, here you are. Bam, got him. Okay. So it looks like we do have some more that we can. Now I'm going to grab a f quite a few guys so we can get them breeding up properly. But we're also going to need to go ahead and steal a few of their workstations. So that is the thing. That looks so cool. It's just kind of off in the distance there. You can just see it rendering in. It hasn't like even fully loaded yet. All right, so we're here back at the base area. We can go ahead and lay some beds down. Uh, Siri wants to Sorry, talk to me. Please, Please don't. Okay, so here we go. Let's go ahead and put some villagers down here. They're going to go ahead and hopefully... 
They won't be making any babies because they don't have their workstations, unfortunately. So we need to make those as well. Oh, cool. We got a bed here. We're going to grab this for a workstation. Grab this for a workstation. Now, what we're going to need is probably a few farmers. Because I do want to set up some farming areas. Uh, oh, hello. Oh, yes. Smithing table, you are mine. Okay, so we even got a vill or a farming villager over here. I'm going to snag him up. going to grab his work bench here. Also going to grab this guy's workbench. Ow. He's probably going to be some salt. Yeah, he's some salt. Going to grab these. I've already been here. Going to grab this bed. There should be a bell somewhere around here, if I'm not mistaken. But these are my villagers now. I have claimed them. I will take care of these guys. It will be awesome. For, for totally for them yeah totally not just for me you know i'm a i'm a good guy all right so we're back here let's go ahead and place our guys down very good very good we got a few beds we can go ahead and add which is awesome and then we're also going to go ahead and add in some other things if we can get a blacksmith that would be phenomenal because we can trade a bunch of coal for him now, i believe I believe we need to make a bell. Can we make one of those? No, you gotta find them. Okay, so I should have one in my inventory over here. Okay, cool. Cool. So we got a, a toolsmith here. So let's go ahead and get a bunch of emeralds going here. Now, the cool thing is the first night we actually should see an iron golem spawn. And then they should be fine after that, which is awesome. Now, we'll eventually move those guys into our into our base here. <clears throat> I'm gonna make these them look like attendants, uh, like they like they work at the at the turtle tower here. That way, they're not enslaved, and we'll also give them uh, uh, money uh, through through good stuff. Uh, trust me, good good money. A super turtle's a good employer. All right, so let's see what we got here. We got a toolsmith, a farmer, a nitwit. So he still hasn't grabbed anything, and then a weapon smith. Ooh, look at that trade. Very cool. Yeah, you try and jump out. You can't do that, buddy. Okay, so we've done that trade. Toolsmith here. Okay, perfect. Look at that. We already got 32 diamonds. That guy's sleeping. Perfect. So this will be classified. That guy's still a nitwit. Toolsmith. Weaponsmith. Weaponsmith. Oh, so he did grab one. So we have three of these trades now. Very cool. Hey, you're not done yet. No, you, you're not done yet. Ooh, we can get a bell, though. Let's go ahead and do that, actually. While we can. Okay, perfect. There are no areas for lighting where anyone can spawn in here, which is good, which is good. Uh, we might need to make it too tall, though, just in case we get any pillagers coming in. Uh, that would be actually pretty smart to do so. So how are you doing? We got You're the bell guy. You bring this to the bounty board decree. Interesting. And you. Interesting. We do have a bounty board that we can place here. Cool. This guy sells carrots so we can buy food from him. Amazing. So what we need to do is have a zombie come over here. Scare these guys so we can get a an iron golem spawned in for them. Um, gonna kidnap a zombie. That's what I'm gonna do. <clears throat> Come here, zombie. I see our guy. There he is. He wants to be part of our team. 
You will help us do many things. So we're not going to put him in there. We're going to put him next to it so he can scare the villagers into making a golem. It's perfect. If we put him here like that, when the villagers see him, oh boy, whoa, so spooky. Come on guys, spawn in a, vill a golem. Oh, I gotta kill these guys. They can't kill my guys. How did you? Okay. Okay, so we've established that this is a village for them, which is awesome. And we've also got an influx of emeralds coming in now, or an area, a way to get emeralds, which is good. Because uh, that means we can also make the emerald upgrades and hold more storage, which is sweet. All right, so if we come down here, we use the emeralds we've gotten. Yes, they will make. Now, if we look here at power, this, this is what we need here, the green guy. Uh, this is what we need. So one to one. So we need a total of four of these guys. So we're gonna need, we're gonna need a lot of these, uh, lots of emeralds. So yeah, we need to get that. I, I will see about getting this automated. But guys, that has been the villager breeder systemer. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, guys. But guys, it's been Super Turtle, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care. Bye bye.